leo nimekuja kumtembelea nabii mahewa hoja tu ah nabii vipi oh hey, vipi wana kwa sana bwana pasha eh hey, naona unasoma gazeti gazeti lasema nini ah niko naangalia jinsi maisha yanapeleka wa Kenya na jinsi watoto wa Mungu wanavyoteseka mhm mm. i did not expect media mm-hmm. ah so unajua sasa mwanangu nime nimekuwa na kwa interview fulani ukasema kwamba uh, kuna nyumba ambayo umejenga specially ya Justina Sokao huyu mwanadada ambaye ni mwimbaji okay before that mm-hmm. naona you tv wako pale mm-hmm. au ni media media gani hao ambao umetembea nao because mm-hmm. You know as a surprise they expect mm-hmm. wageni kwangu. Mm-hmm. Ah, ni wengine tu. Ni TV gani umekuja na watu wangapi? Hawaji mm-hmm. mimi ndio hapa peke yangu. Labda mm-hmm. watakuomba pia ruhusa ndio. Labda. You know mm-hmm. this is a surprise for my African queen. Mm-hmm. I don't expect a uh, uh, wageni mm-hmm. because nataka ikuwe surprise mm-hmm. and I can invite you wakati ambapo mimi nimetaka. So mm-hmm. just because I'm a man of God mm-hmm. I'll give you my attention. Mm-hmm. Maybe unataka nini? Unataka yeah. kujua nini? Naona nyumba ni hii na guess ni kwa sababu si ile yako main yenye nimezoea kukuja. Naona hii ni a different kind of house. So hii ndio unasema unatengea Justina. Yeah, so mm-hmm. totally this compound yote. Mm-hmm. This compound kutoka kule. Mm-hmm. Kila kitu hapa I've uh, constructed everything mm-hmm. just for Justina. Mm-hmm. And I've decided it to be a price mm-hmm. uh, that one is my main house mm-hmm. this one is my main house mm-hmm. oh this Na, one yeah this one is my main house mm-hmm. na hii nimetenga kando because when justina atakuja kwangu mm-hmm. nataka nimfanyie mambo na cleansing mm-hmm. for for the for the whole month mambo nafanywe cleansing kwanza sisi tangamana na watenda zambi mm-hmm. so lazima akija hapa mm-hmm ataka kwenye hii room amba, hii nyumba ambayo nimemtengea special room mm-hmm. eh nimfanyie tabaka mbalimbali mm-hmm. nimfanyie total cleansing mm-hmm. kwa sababu hata hii nyumba yenyewe mm-hmm. vile iko tu na kila kitu hapa mm-hmm. ni imefa, imefanywa with the purpose ukiangalia mm-hmm. this tree a friend of mine from Nigeria mm-hmm. alinipatia na haikukuja hai ikiwa ndogo mm-hmm. ilikuwa seedling kadogo ilikuwa kubwa Yeah. This tree a friend from Nigeria ilikuja ikiwa kubwa mm-hmm. na kazi yake ni kazi mingi sana na unaona this one mm-hmm. this one Justina in case ako na shida ama mtu yeyote ako na shida mm-hmm. akinipigia simu au tuongee kwenye simu mm-hmm. when that person tells me all the problems they are passing mm-hmm. na ni, when i come and stand here this way mm-hmm. shida zote na jinsi ya kutatua zile shida mm-hmm. i see them yani una just point there. yeah when eh, niki nikisimama niangalie this direction ya hii miti mm-hmm. so unaweza ona the grounds mm-hmm. as ya kuwa finished mm-hmm. kutengenezwa mm-hmm. hata maua sijamaliza kuweka because mm-hmm. i don't know justina's test true kwa sababu nimetaka a friend of mine ambaye anafanya na KQ wala ambao wana transport uh, maua mm-hmm. zikienda ngambo mm-hmm. nimetaka Justina kisha ingia hapa. Mm-hmm. I'll call the friend so that Justina amueleze anapenda maua type gani. Mm-hmm. Kama ni white mm-hmm. lakini wanawake wanapenda rose flowers. I don't know Justina's test. Mm-hmm. That's why nimeachana na hii space hivyo upande wa maua. Mm-hmm. Hizi ambazo nimeweka this ones ziko na kazi yake mm-hmm. kwa magonjwa mbalimbali, ziko na kazi yake kwa kutibu magonjwa tofauti mm-hmm. na vitu tofauti. Unajua wa Kenya wana Mm-hmm. At not only Kenyans mm-hmm. people from the world they are suffering mm-hmm. so when they come for mm-hmm. help mm-hmm. i help them in different ways mm-hmm. uh, i can use uh, some vegetation mm-hmm. to help them some mm-hmm. maombi tu mm-hmm. inamaliza kila kitu nabii labda tuingie ndani kabla ndani kwa mm-hmm. pole you have come in my compound and you must follow mm-hmm. what uh, you want to know mm-hmm. what i want to show justina mm-hmm. you see imiti hii miti nimeipanda hapa for a purpose kwa Justina. Mm-hmm. Na hii miti ya special tree. This one. this one is a special tree mm-hmm. ilitoka Ghana. Eh? Yeah, ilitoka Ghana and this place ambayo nimeitenga hapa mm-hmm. unaona wanawake sometimes mm-hmm. huwa wanapenda hiyo mambo ya maji kuruka ruka nje mm-hmm. ya nyumba yao. Mm-hmm. So water thing itakuwa hapa ambapo 
sijajua kama ataipenda uh-huh. huenda kitu ambacho kimenzuia kuweka hiyo water fence hapa uh-huh. labda angetaka statue yangu uh-huh. ikuwe hapa uh-huh. uwezi jua uh-huh. so labda angetaka the yule landscape aitishe statue yangu uh-huh. itengenezwe hapa ama ile water fountain au yeah, yale maji ambayo yanaruka juu ya kijiji mm. yarudia yale yes alafu mm. ukiangalia the material nimetumia kuunda hii nyumba yake mm-hmm. this material is not found easily na ni material ambayo imetakasika this grass yes hii uh-huh. nyazi imetakasika uh-huh. uwezi ipata mahali popote uh-huh. so akiwa hapa ndani uh-huh. wale wachawi wanaruka ruka hawezi ruka around uh-huh. so i come in I'm uh-huh. see, i can see some birds oh ina maana nini labda nabii okay this birds sir uh-huh zina represent my leadership mm-hmm. and the hierarchy of leadership mm-hmm. from god mm-hmm. to man mm-hmm. and most of the, of it uh, ilinikujia kwa ndoto mm-hmm. na Mungu akaniambia fanya hivi mm-hmm. ukiangalia their colors most of them ina represent mm-hmm. the way i dress mm-hmm. you see this one mm-hmm. iko na red pick mm-hmm. na this one ndio leader mm-hmm. being the leader mm-hmm. you can see the red pick Mm-hmm. ina present ni kwangu. Mm-hmm. Apart from that utaona hii. Oh, green. The yellow mm-hmm. and green. Mm-hmm. This yellow and green. Mm-hmm. Ina represent nini? It has a meaning. Mm-hmm. Then uh, the red one mm-hmm. you can just see mambo mengine. Naona pete pale red. <laughs> mm-hmm. Okay. Na nabii dhahabu bwana this gold. Well, mambo na dhahabu achana nayo mm-hmm. kwanza. Mm-hmm. You see people wataanza kuongea mm-hmm. na bia na nika vile ako na mamilioni mm-hmm. eh wachana na vitu mm-hmm. hii na toka wapi ama ile gari mpesa ngapi sasa hii okay najua watu watadharau kwa sababu nilinunua some few millions mm-hmm. and i don't care how they gonna talk about my watch mm-hmm. sikatai i bought it some few millions mm-hmm. and some other things eh, like the pete mm-hmm iko na kazi yake we can go in mm-hmm. iko na kazi yake tofauti mm-hmm. so this place is just for justina mm-hmm. a surprise mali ataka one month mm-hmm. nikimfanyia cleansing mm-hmm. so hapa mm-hmm. this is uh, her bed mm-hmm. ini bed ya justina mm-hmm. atakuwa analala hapa hata tuashie mwangaza kwa kamera ndio kwa kamera mani aweze kuona mm-hmm. okay so justina atakuwa anakuja ana switch Mm-hmm. I have uh, three lights. Mm-hmm. Kuna hii hapa. Mm-hmm. Kuna hii hapa juu na kuna hii hapa. Mm-hmm. And this one. Mm-hmm. So the three lights niliamua kumwekea hapa the buttons. Mm-hmm. Atafinya ile ya pale mwisho inaaka. Mm-hmm. Anafinya hiyo ya juu inaaka. Mm-hmm. Anafinya ile ya juu inaaka. Mm-hmm. So akisikia kijoto joto nimemnunulia hii. Mm-hmm. Uh, some few thousand shillings. Mm-hmm nimeunulia this one mm-hmm. na nitumie niliamua nitumie this uh, modern way mm-hmm. unaona hii nilinunua this one costed me around uh, 700000 mm-hmm. niliamua it simple as it looks eh uh, yeah, simple mm-hmm. hii mm-hmm. I, i just took some 700000 mm-hmm. nikaamua nimnunulie hii iko na mpaka draw hapa mm-hmm. Oh, oh the real african the real african na nabi labda kabla ni kuna kitu ambacho nimeona kwenye hii nyumba mm. why is it an african setup naona kuna yani haya material ni african setup lights everything grass touched mm na mbona mbona ni african setup okay set-up. niliamua kuifanya in african setup because mm. you see i want to treat justina mm. as an african queen mm-hmm. being an african queen mm-hmm. i should invite her in an african stylish mm-hmm. ambaye imejengwa kiafrika she is going to be my queen mm-hmm. and she's not from european mm-hmm. she's an african mm-hmm. queen mm-hmm. i decided to create everything to look like mm-hmm. the real africa so mm-hmm. i'll uh, take you in this mm-hmm. tv mm-hmm. Uh-huh. so this place mm-hmm. this place ni mahali ambapo mm-hmm. justina atafanya refreshment mm-hmm na pia akitaka mambo na chakula chakula mm-hmm. ku storage ama nini mm-hmm. iko huko sasa hapa ni mali pa refreshment mm-hmm. this one is ha uh, hapa atakuwa naoga mm-hmm. atakuwa naoga hii ni shower mm-hmm. this is shower na kuna type mbili and it is hot water mm-hmm. na ukiangalia mm-hmm. nimetengeneza kwa shimo hivi mm-hmm. ukiangalia the tomb of jesus christ mm-hmm. ile ile mali Yesu alizikwa ilikuwa kwa njia ya kama hivi hapa mm-hmm. atakuwa naeka sabuni yake 
So ma, pale mahali nimetengeneza in a Jewish way. Mm-hmm. This is a Jewish style ambapo itamfanya akuwe fully mm-hmm. cleansed. Mm-hmm. So she can use both showers mm-hmm. e, ama this one. Uh-huh. So nimetaka ni I want to treat her like a real queen. Mm-hmm. So akishamaliza sarakasi zake hapa ameosha kila mahali mm-hmm. amenyonyoa nywele ambazo labda ziko unwanted kwa mwili mm-hmm. atakuja hapa. Uh-huh. Hapa hivi atajitazama kwa kio vizuri mm-hmm. ajione vile hako mrembo. You know when you want to know how beautiful mm-hmm. or handsome you are mm-hmm. stay naked in front of her. Mm-hmm. Mira. Wow. Stay naked in front of a mirror. That's new to me. You will see mm-hmm how beautiful or handsome you are mm-hmm. and how mm-hmm. unatunza mm-hmm. viungo ambavyo Mwenyezi Mungu alikupatia mm-hmm. so come to the kitchen mm-hmm. na pia kabla ya kitchen yes. iki kitanda will you be sharing with Justina iki kitanda no for the one month i can't share the bed with mm-hmm. Justina mm-hmm. to me mm-hmm. Justina is a sinner mm-hmm. to me mm-hmm. ni mtenda zambi mm-hmm. so i can't share the bed mm-hmm with the mtenda zambi mm. mpaka kwa cleansed yeah. for the one month atakuwa mm. analala peke yake mm. na nitakuwa namwombea Mungu mm. aweze kumkimu for the one month avumilie mm-hmm. before ahamie kwa my main house mm-hmm. so that's it mm-hmm. so apart uh, apart from that Justina anapenda mambo na makeups mm-hmm. eh anapenda aonekane mzuri unajua wanasema kitu kizuri kinampendeza mume kweli so this is where atakuwa anafanya vile sarakasi za uso nini ana there's a chair ile ya ngozi nitamwekea hapa atakuwa anajiangalia akifanya this is our kitchen hapa ni vitu mahali pa kuweka tu vyombo the drawers i bought her this fridge tayari nimeshaweka some food stuffs ndani uh, maybe I think sija unlock nitachukua mm-hmm. kifungu pale mm-hmm. food stuff ziko hapa mm-hmm. na utaona kila kitu mm-hmm. Nime, niliamua sasa ya sima atumie meko mm-hmm. sasa ki atumie jiko ama gas mm-hmm. ya kawaida mm-hmm. I want her to feel best mm-hmm. under Nabima Hewas Empire mm-hmm. you see mm-hmm. nikaamua kuchukua some little money mm-hmm. chukua pesa kidogo kwa kwa one of my accounts ni kama chukulia hii mm-hmm. so this kitchen no no had wifi eh, yes mm. this one mm-hmm. a friend of mine who is working with a great company mm-hmm. in south africa mm-hmm. aliniambia atasimamia bill ya kila kitu you know mm-hmm. ukisaidia mtu akienda pale mm-hmm. akishafanikiwa mm-hmm. that guy came to me akiwa na shida sana mm-hmm. nikamsaidia and he went in south africa anafanya pale Johannesburg mm-hmm. in a very big office mm-hmm. so akaniambia nabi if there is anything you want mm-hmm. just say akaniambia my all compound iko na wifi mm-hmm. the all compound has a wifi mm-hmm. akasema atasimamia for 10 years mm-hmm. yes oh na what about the e roof yeah, it's uh, it's kind of unique eh? mm-hmm. kule nje ni nyasi lakini hapa naona ni So maybe what inspired you kujenga kitu kama roof kama hii? Okay, kitu mm-hmm. cha kwanza mm-hmm. African houses. Mm-hmm. Uh, you know this type of a house. Mm-hmm. Msimu wa baridi kutakuwa mm-hmm. na joto hapa. Mm-hmm. Na msimu wa joto joto mm-hmm. baridi inakuja. Mm-hmm. So ina ina ina, ina iko very able to sustain mm-hmm. the climate change. Mm-hmm. Na that one I did it because I don't want my African queen mm-hmm. at a seke. Mm-hmm. I want to give her the life she has, she has never tested. Mm-hmm. Mimi I don't care how many men amekuwa now or boys. I don't care. Mm-hmm. I want to take her mm-hmm. to a real empire. Mm-hmm. Na ini baadhi ya ufalme mm-hmm. ambao nataka apitie. Mm-hmm. Kama vile Daudi alimwambia Mungu mm-hmm. nitakujengea mm-hmm. ufalme ambapo watu wako watakuwa na kuabudu. Mm-hmm. So nataka kufanya kila mbinu ni hakisha Justina mm-hmm ana respect Mungu mm-hmm. na juu ya kwamba kila kitu mm-hmm. it is uh, inawezekana kwa Mungu. Mm-hmm. Yes. Kwenye interview na one of the media stations ndio na kwamba unasema you want two only two uh, children with Justina na lazima wakuwa wa kiume. So labda pia clarify hapo mbona wa kiume. Okay, mimi mm-hmm. kulingana na yale Mungu alinionyesha. Mm-hmm. God told me I'm giving you this old woman. Mm-hmm. She's old. So God according to ile ujumbe nilipata kutoka kwa Mungu mm. God want me and Justina to have only two 
mm. kids na watakuwa watoto wa kiume. Mm. So hawa watoto wa kiume mm. watamtumikia Mungu the whole of their lives. Mm. Because it is believed there is time for everything. Mm. The time for Nabi Mahewa will come mm. and go. Mm-hmm. And when my time expires, mm-hmm. who will inherit me? Mm-hmm. The two boys. Mm-hmm. And ile instruction tawapatia the two boys ni kwamba watakuwa na watoto. Mm-hmm. They should choose from their kids mm-hmm. wale ambao watamserve Mungu. Mm-hmm. To make sure that we are serving God in the right manner mm-hmm. and in the truthful direction. 